hey guys welcome to alien defense entertainment if you are new to this channel please do hit that subscribe button and turn on the notification bell so that you don't miss a video upload by me every time i upload a new one okay on the waking of the coronavirus of which like it seems to be spreading really i wouldn't say rapidly but it is really gaining momentum within the country within our shores in south africa and like uh, the government is really trying to do whatever they can to curb the spread of the virus but then many people are just asking Oguti, is it really enough that they are just talking there are no facilities that are being allocated for those people that are you know like uh, having the virus and who have tested rather positive for the virus and like they are saying Oguti, those people who came from wuhan in china they are like kept in an isolated place that is okay fine they are understandable but it is just not fair for those people that already have a virus and that they have to live within the communities and, you know, like self-quarantine, as the government is saying. Like they are saying, Nguti, if you know yourself that you have been outside of the country and you have recently been back, especially on those hard hit uh, countries such as uh, China or U.S. or um canada or italy or whatever the cases may be but if you know you have been in some of those places that have a problem of coronavirus you should know that you have to self-quarantine yes i understand that one if like you have been inside and then you have not yet tested positive uh, for the virus and then like you have to self-quarantine for those certain number of days and then like you have the, then you have to test again but then the issue is what about those people that have tested positive why are they being self-quarantined why is there no one you know like taking you know like making sure that the people really are quarantined and that they are li really not you know like going out into the communities and spreading the virus because it, like i'm not i'm not trying to say that you know like there are people who are doing it in the country but but if one is to check and maybe there is some of you that have seen something like that happening people going around you know like spreading you know like uh, taking out spit and actually like smearing it on some certain surfaces for people to come and touch and of which like it is really not acceptable we should as people human beings let me say it doesn't matter who you are or which class you come from but we should just you know like value each other's life if you got the disease it doesn't mean it is the end of the road the government is saying some some official mini, uh, uh, parliamentary officials are saying Uguti, like i mean sorry the government official not parliamentary the government official are saying that uh, there is a 80 percent chance that if you contract the vir virus you can be okay of which like 80 percent is really like a significant number so like seriously i don't see why people if like they have the disease they should really uh, panic because it is not the end of the road you know people have been healed around the world yes i'm not saying like healed as in like you're going to church and then a pastor lays hands on you and then they tell you you are healed no not that one they have received the medication excuse me medical attention and then they have come out fine and if you like like you can check out like on youtube just google people that have survived the, the coronavirus and you will see like there is a significant number of people and then they are not afraid of speaking out about it you know like calming down the panic that is happening around the world yes it is like seriously like a a, a everybody is afraid let me say so everybody has got that certain little level of panic but it's not really something that it should be really happening okay now back into what is it the government is saying about this our government in the country of south africa is saying that we should you know like uh, make sure that they, we are not in gatherings that are more than 100 you know groups of people and we should try to you know like uh, stay safe as much as possible practice good hygiene as much as possible and they have prohibited or rather banned some 
travels, air travels, and also like they have closed some borders, both internationally and those like our neighboring borders. They especially like they started today with our neighboring borders, and then like for some like especially schools on Wednesday they have announced that the government has president rather has announced that. Um, schools are to be shut down and like until like it's at least the end of easter and like seriously like maybe not maybe it is like a good way of trying to curb the spread of the virus you know within the community because like honestly like this thing if really it keeps on spreading like it's going to be devastating for our country not just south africa but also the continent especially that we know that um as a continent we don't have a adequate you know health care system like we are really lacking behind yes like some countries like germany they have issued you know like monies to say like um they are willing to give a helping hand example for like they're giving out 200 i will not 200 excuse me 2.5 million rand you know like in order to help with what is needed for like example sanitation and mask and whatnot you know and for testing you know like the equipment means let me say it like that uh they didn't say like seriously like a mask or whatever but they said the word that they used was um the equipment for you know like testing and you know like just trying to help out on the country and that was the germany embassy who tra who was talking to the one of the, the media big houses here in our country so i really don't know what do you have to say or add or whatever but do comment down below and tell me Uwuti, like how do you feel how 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 do you see things panning out and like is is there really need to be panicking because honestly i don't see it we've been dealing with flu for a really long time you know as the world as the globe and like seriously as statistics say Uwuti, like um the flu virus has been killing a lot of number people a number of people in the year but you can go ahead and you know like search for it and check out the statistics on your own and then just see Uguti, like are there no similarities and like seriously like i really don't know much about the virus i'm just going on what i've been hearing and what i have been reading i still stand to be corrected so if ever you want to correct me do go ahead but then what i can say is please be respectful in your comments and you know like we are all learning we are all afraid to a certain extent i won't lie and say like we should just keep calm and whatever yes we do think we could see what can happen ahead you know but there's no need to go you know like haywire and stuff like that so do go ahead and comment and tell me let me know what do you think and like what measures are you taking as an individual as a family as a community what are you doing out there to make sure that you know like you are limiting the means of the virus coming to you and your family and your loved ones in the uh, community and if you have not yet subscribed please do subscribe and turn on the notification bell so that you become one of the very first people to receive my notifications every time i upload a video and remember that i am loving you but i can never love you more than god can love you